Hello and welcome to another video of I am a super user and topic of PFSense and once again this is Noriel. So if you remember uh, we already done creating a video on how to block YouTube using PFSense and OpenDNS so today's video will be uh, related to this video okay so uh, for example you already have your PFSense and configured uh, OpenDNS to block uh, YouTube or other websites that you uh, set on this uh, web filtering list here on OpenDNS the problem is your user can easily change the uh, uh, DNS settings on their computer and once they change that they can uh, bypass the filtering that you made here on your OpenDNS and PFSense firewall so today's video will uh, help you on how uh, you could prevent that to uh, how you could prevent your users to do that okay so for this example I will show you that I block the gambling uh, category so my PFSense and OpenDNS will work together to block the gambling uh, category websites so let me show you that by of course accessing a gambling website <coughs> uh, let's say this one See online gambling sites. So th should, uh, this one should be uh, fall onto the gambling category. Okay, let's open this website. Okay, continue. Okay. <coughs> So it says uh, this domain is black due to content filtering. So I have a custom message here and my custom logo. So it says uh, it is black. Uh, go connect to other network if you insist. Okay, so it is black. <coughs> but I will show you now that I, as a user, could easily change the DNS settings here on my network. Let me show you that one okay so I will go here on my network uh, connections and then <coughs> I will uh, change the settings on my uh, IPv4 settings properties here so let's say I'll change that to 8 8 8.8.8.8 8 .8 .8. so that's the Google public DNS so uh, before I will uh, click OK let me show you that I can ping Google ping google.com <coughs> so we have a reply that means uh, our connection is uh, fine okay so now let me uh, change the DNS okay and then I'll save the settings and then I'll go back to okay so let's go to the command prompt ping Google again so still uh, although I changed the DNS to 8.8.8.8 I still have internet connection and let's go back here in our uh, let's uh, try to open the gambling website again gambling the same way that we opened it earlier gambling <coughs> okay so as you can see I can access the gambling website now so in short I bypass the uh, open DNS filtering <laughs> that my network administrator uh, is a uh, setup have set up so let's uh, close this one let me <coughs> refresh this oops uh, 
uh, let me complete. Mm -hmm. So I think let me uh, clear. I think let's just create let's gambling. So uh, if you see that I can access the mm -hmm. Set. Google gambling. gambling. You should access that. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's try on. Uh, oops. <coughs> Let's try. Actually, I want to try on the Chrome browser. So let's go here. Okay, so as you can see, I can access also <coughs> on different browsers. So that means I bypass this uh, web filtering that OpenDNS and PFSense uh, created or has for the network. Okay, so what what you can do to prevent that is to create a rule on your PFSense to force uh, the computers on your network to use the uh, whatever is the DNS that you are set on your firewall so in our case we set it to use the open DNS so we could have the filtering that we have <coughs> so but uh, like I said uh, it will uh, the rule that we will be creating right now it will force the computer on your networks to use these uh, DNS servers but in our case today it's the open DNS uh, DNS server so let's go to firewall rules go to LAN and then let's create a new rule let's call it pass uh, select the TCP UDP and the destination here Oops, uh, the destination type is uh, network uh, LAN address I'm sorry then the destination port range is 53 for the DNS you can opt to uh, log the packets and let's say allow DNS or allowed DNS yeah, you can name uh, whatever you like. Then let's check again. Pass LAN IPv4 TCP UDP source any destination LAN address destination port 53 save apply changes. Okay. <coughs> then let's create another rule under this uh, rule that we have created. Uh, but this time it uh, should be black so the same uh, settings but almost the same but yeah the action should be black destination should be any and still 53 port 53 and then let's say black other DNS <coughs> So uh, then click save, apply changes, close. So what we did is to, uh, the rule will allow the users to use only the uh, 
DNS server that you set here. So whatever uh, DNS server you entered here, that will uh, force uh, PFSense to force the uh, uh, users to use that. And if they change the DNS settings on their computer, uh, they will be black and uh, won't have a internet connection because they cannot query to other DNS servers. They cannot send a request. Okay, so let's see if that works. Let's go back here in our. Oh, let me access uh, again first the. Uh, to kill this. Oh, let's. Uh, first, let's. Uh, go back to our default settings first. Okay. Okay. Let me double check it. Yeah. So that's the default settings that we have. Then let's try to ping Google again. Yes, we have a connection. Then let's try to access the gambling again. <coughs> it is black. So our filtering is working right now. Okay, because uh, we uh, revert or uh, change back to the default settings here in our Ethernet settings, on our network settings. So the site is again black. Okay, so this time it's that this time that we have created the rule that we have here. Let's try to. Okay, so that uh, after we created the rule that we have here. Uh, let's try to uh, change the settings again in our uh, what do you call this? Where is it? Okay. <coughs> so let's try to change like what we did uh, earlier. Let's make this eight 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 eight. Okay, close. Okay, and then let's now let's try to be in Google. Jadan, <coughs> as you can see, it's uh, we don't have any reply or the uh, ping uh, request just stuck up, and then if we go here. in our uh, gambling.com we don't have actually an <laughs> internet connection so yeah so the uh, rule works so the user now uh, doesn't have any internet connection as you can see here <coughs> doesn't have uh, any a reply from the ping request and yeah even Google mm -hmm. google.com yeah because of the rule we just created and Let's try to have a here Google. Okay, <coughs> so that uh, that's the uh, effect of the rules that we created here in our PF Sense. So that way, <coughs> uh, the user doesn't have any option but to change uh, the settings back to the default settings that you set and that uh, in that case uh, you will have the uh, control again you will enforce your filtering again okay so let's uh, set the uh, settings back <coughs> okay 
then obtain okay close now let's try to ping Google again we have that internet connection and let's try to access the gambling website again and that should be black again Okay, let's try here in another browser. Gumbling.com. <coughs> okay, so it is, uh, as you can see, it's uh, being black by the uh, uh, what we set on our PFSense, uh, on our uh, DNS. Okay. So I hope that helps uh, you again, guys. So in case that uh, you have any questions and problem in your settings, just uh, leave your comments on the comment section below, and I will try to attend to your queries. But uh, before you ask anything, uh, just uh, try to follow first and understand the instructions on my videos. Okay, so. Again, the this uh, firewall rules uh, will enforce uh, the rule on your network to use the uh, DNS server that you entered here. And in our case, it's Open DNS because we want to have this web filtering. So, in uh, uh, the result will be uh, your user can change although yes he can change the uh, DNS settings on her uh, on his uh, network setup but he won't have uh, internet connection so he will be probably forced to uh, go back to the default settings and accept that you enforce the web filtering on your network okay so thanks for watching again guys and I hope you continue to support my uh, uh, blog and my YouTube channel by hitting like and subscribing and sharing the video if it was helpful okay thank you and God bless